Good day, this is Dr. Nick coming to you from the future of leadership and as you can see I'm recording at Comedy Central um, where Trevor Noah and other great comedians are coming to elevate the audience and this is what I want to talk to you about today. I want to talk how to future-proof your career and what are the skills you need today to be equipped for tomorrow and to flourish in the new world in the future. Now, I just read an article um, about AI, artificial intelligence, and the author was saying that uh, the way to future-proof your career is to embrace AI, to learn uh, about AI, to apply AI. And to me, this is just the one side of the coin, because the other side, and I think the most important side, is to learn human intelligence and to build relationships. Now, this is clearly the single most important competency, skill and asset in this new economy, in the new world, in the future, to build relationships. Now, how do you build meaningful relationships? You certainly don't build them online. You have to build them face to face. You have to make time to meet people, to listen to people and to understand what is driving them, to understand what they are going through. That takes, on average, once you harness this technique, and it has to be genuine, it takes, on average, three hours. It takes a solid three hours of listening to somebody to really connect with them on a soul-to-soul -soul level and to understand who they are, what is driving them, and what they're going through in their own life. Now, when you have dinner with a group, on average, this will take four hours. Four hours of your time, four solid hours to really connect on a deep level, to share and to understand each other better. You have to make time for this. You have to make time for relationship building because at the end of the day, your success in life, in business, in your career, in anything depends on the strength of your relationships. So how do you build strong relationships? You do what all the great teachers have been telling us over the ages of humanity, and that is to elevate others. You need to elevate others. And that's a skill that former President Clinton said Madiba, the greatest skill he had, Nelson Mandela, was that skill of making everybody feel bigger. And that, according to Bill Clinton, is an uncommon skill. So not to focus on yourself, not to focus on how you can, be, can, can become bigger, but how you can make others feel bigger. If you do that, and if you practice it, and if you apply that, you will build relationships that will last for life. And I've been doing that in my interview series on the future of leadership, where I interview leaders, I profile leaders, I turn it in these interviews into a book, so I profile them in the interview, I profile them online, I profile them in a book, I profile them and I elevate them at the Future of Leadership Summit. If you do that, you will build relationships where people will want to help you. In fact, I had a number of times now, people comment, tell me that, just tell me how I can help you, um, and I will. Um, that's the level and the depth of relationships you can build. And please remember, critically important, you have to find out and empathize with what people are going through. Recently, earlier this week, two very close dear friends of mine for the first time confided to me what they are going through. And that, first of all, elevated the relationship to a totally new, different level. And it allowed me to apply the most valuable skill of all, the most valuable skill of humanity, which is empathy. So they gave a gift to me by sharing what they are going through. So you have to do the same, you have to give the gift, you have to give the gift of empathy to others, you have to open up, you have to share your greatest vulnerability, you have to share what you're going through. Because remember, we are all going through transitions in our life, we are all going through pains, we are all going through trials and tribulations. Once you share that with others, you allow them to open up, to be more genuine, to be more authentic, to be more real and to be more raw. So that's what you need to focus on, master and learn and apply 
the skill of building meaningful, deep, le soul level relationships and you will future proof your career for many, many years to come.